Hi everyone, this is Miss Emil and welcome back to my channel once again. I know it's been such a long time. Well, I'm not gonna give any kind of explanation here. And yeah, without much further delay, let's get started with the video. So it's 4 a.m. in the morning and I always start my day with a prayer thanking God for blessing me with another beautiful life and another opportunity. So as soon as I'm done with my prayer, I make sure to arrange my bed because there is a saying right that cleanliness starts from your bedroom. So yeah, um, I'm not saying that I'm a very clean and hygienic person but yeah, that's a very basic and common thing that we all must do, right? So, and yeah, here is the view. It's pretty cold in the morning and right now I have already washed my face. I haven't shoot that part and it's time for me to pamper my skin with this morning skincare routine. First, I apply a little bit of toner on my face, then go with the essence and of course a moisturizer, that is a morning nectar moisturizer. And the final and the most important step is to apply sunscreen on your face or on your skin. You better apply sunscreen before you go out so that you can stay protected from sun rays and UV rays. And that's me combing my hair, whatever. Duh. So yeah, that's the simple skincare routine that I follow every morning. And right now, I'm gonna go and choose an outfit for a day. So I'm looking for an outfit and I'm confused on whether to go for a black or white t-shirt. And I ended up wearing white t-shirt this time, otherwise it's always black no matter what. Anyways, um, these days I am attending prayer and fasting program so that is why I woke up early in the morning just to go for a prayer and fasting program and that's my cute cognac bag made by my mom. I am kinda getting late so yeah, I'm heading out. Say hi to our pig. Is eating and yeah that's our back door I prefer to go out from the back door so that I don't disturb my parents while they are asleep so yes let's head out here I am looking all pale one thing I learned about waking up early in the morning is that it's really refreshing especially when you go out for a morning walk like this so yeah I, I hope that I'll continue Waking up early in the morning, even next time. I don't know where we're gonna fly like you did sometimes. Seeing eyes of mine. Six hours later. So it was already 12 pm in the afternoon, and me and my friend we were heading back home. We had to stop by the bookstore to take her book. Anyways, I am home guys and as you can see from the way I walk, I was really tired and at the same time I was not feeling well. I got changed and went down to the kitchen to fill up my stomach and after having my brunch, I went to a nearby stationery to get some Xerox done for my work and yeah, as always, I had to sit back and work on my computer preparing some notes for the students. I was really stressed out so I decided to take a short nap before I go out or head out for another busy schedule so yes I had to take a power back nap. So after getting an hour of sleep I was kind of feeling a little bit better. So I went down and had to freshen up again before I go out for my tutoring classes. And right now I'm putting some ointment on my scars. And let me get changed in 3, 2, 1. That was a loop sheet transition anyways. That was an outfit for an evening. And let me put some perfume. Because who knows, on the way you might meet someone you like or your crush, no? So you have to smell good. 
Anyways, it's me again, that same boring face. And for those of you who have never visited Mon, Mon is very similar to Kohima, which means you have to climb up every day. And yeah, this is the hostel where I'm teaching. After tutoring for more than an hour, I decided to go and visit my grandma. Hi. So yeah, here is my niece, <laughs> and that's my cute How nephew. Are you? I'm fine. Wow. <laughs> They were indeed very excited to see me. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Meet my grandmother. That's my mommy come mom. <laughs> so after spending some quality time with them, I decided to head back home as it was already getting late. And after reaching home, I had my dinner. And once again, meet my another granny, which is my dedica mom. After having my dinner and having done some other works, I went back inside my room and started checking some answer script of my students and started making some notes and was kind of busy reading some books and preparing. So yeah, that's that was all and. It was already 11 past p.m. So I had to end my video here. And yeah, that's it for this video. Please like, share and subscribe to my channel if you like the video. And yeah, lots of love for always supporting me. I'll see you all in my next vlog. Take care. Bye-bye. Love you all.